Have you got a contract for me? Not only does this quest pay, but you get to have fun doing it. Probably. Welcome to Assassin's Creed Valhalla. Amber here with some tips on how to complete the Reda contracts quickly so you can get more XP fast. So here I'm at the forest hideout in East Anglia. This just happened to be one of the daily contracts when I filmed this, although it could be different for you. There's usually two daily contracts and one weekly contracts, and they all award opals and XP. And the way to complete them more quickly, so you can complete often two in just five or ten minutes, I find that staying in stealth, if possible, will let you do them faster. So that's why I infiltrated this bandit camp by going over the tree branch. And now I'm going to use Odin Sight to identify the prisoner that I'm supposed to be freeing. Oh, and you can see they're below me above the fireplace. So now I'm going to go over to the other side of the camp. And the reason you want to remain undetected is because to complete the quest, you have to be anonymous. So if you enter combat, then you're going to have to spend time running away from the camp. Let me just get this enemy. If you trigger combat, you'll have to spend more time running away from the camp to become anonymous. Whereas if you stay in stealth undetected like I'm doing now, you're going to be anonymous immediately when you leave the camp. And I'm going to use Blinding Rush melee ability here to stop time and go around and free this prisoner. I love Blinding Rush ability, but if you don't have it, you don't need to use it. You just have to go behind the prisoner. And now... I've freed the prisoner without being detected, so I can immediately walk a short distance from the camp and the prisoner follows me and I will complete the contract. So in just a couple minutes, I've completed this contract. I'm going to get five opals and I got 450 XP. I'm using the XP boost. Let's look at one more example. So here's another common type of contract. This one is Leicestershire and it's kill the target or assassinate the target. And again, if possible, it's often quicker to stay in stealth. So I'm gonna climb into the camp using the tree branch and I'm gonna use Odin Sight again to identify my target. Oh, and there they are near the fireplace. So now I can sneak in, trying to stay undetected. Oh, and here I'm going to use chain assassination. So chain assassination is a skill in the Raven skill tree that'll let you assassinate a second target with that axe throw who's in close proximity to the first. And here is the enemy that I need to kill to complete this contract. Done. And so in less than four minutes, I've completed both of these daily contracts. And again, the daily contracts are going to be different whenever you see this video but they're usually pretty quick to complete, especially if you use stealth like I showed you. And the third type of contract you might see, in addition to the kill the target and free the prisoner, is the kill the predator. I won't do an example of that, but my tip for that one is to use your raven, to use Sinan, to find the animal that you're supposed to kill and mark them so it's easier to track them down. One other thing, if you don't see Retta, you might need to progress the story. You won't see Retta at your settlement in England until you've completed your first pledge. And for more tips and tricks, see my playlist, which I'll link in the description. Thanks for watching and subscribe to my channel for more guides and gameplay.